Hi YouTubers, it's been a minute since I put something out there, but I uh, figured I'd video this. Uh, got uh, got Miss Barbara's John Deere back out here. You see I got the carburetor off of it. When it started a while ago, wouldn't start, wouldn't run. Grab a can of ether, spray it, start. So, gas issue. Well, uh, a lot of these, a lot of these gas lines have been, been kind of hard. I did a tune-up on it probably six months ago, and uh, when she got it back, it would run a little while and then it would quit. And then she'd get back on it and it'd run a little while and then it'd quit. Well, uh, she just dealt with it, but uh, she broke. Uh, Broke this piece here off a of deck, and uh, I welded it back on there for her. And I'm, I've had it, I've had it too long actually, trying to, trying to figure out what was wrong with it. And uh, I didn't want to go replacing parts, spending a bunch of money and guessing at it. I don't like throwing parts at uh, problems. But uh, like I said, I fired it up earlier. Let me sit down here and grab this gas and I'll show y'all. But I uh, pulled the carburetor off of it and I noticed what come out of the carburetor was not... was not gas. And uh, any of y'all know what gas, what water does in gas, right there it is. Water's heavier than gas and it will not mix. So it'll go to the bottom of your tank and collect and uh, suck it all into your fuel system and then you got issues. But uh, I was going to replace this line here because it's it's pretty dry rotted from the filter back. I didn't, I didn't do it last time. I should have. But I got to looking at it. I mean it's it run uh, well you can see where I cut it there but the gas tanks under the seat I've done pulled the tank but uh, I think I figured out the problem where it's getting water in it um, she keeps it in a shed when I had it out over here I mean I'd cover it up every once in a while but uh, let's see focus but as you can see this is a pickup tube it goes down in there and you see the, the little rubber grommets all mashed up and it wasn't I noticed that first thing it wasn't even in there so the gas cap comes through the fender I guess all that water was collecting here what water it did get on it and it was just running right in here so I'm gonna clean this up and see if I can find something in my junk that'll match this put her back together and put her some new fuel line on and uh, maybe I can get her back on it tomorrow but uh, yeah she's she's an elderly lady but uh, she don't she don't like nobody else to mow her yard she likes to do it do it herself she enjoys it so uh, I mean, I'll probably charge her a little bit of nothing. I had to go pick it up, bring it, uh, take it back to her and everything. But, uh, you know, it's her out there doing that yard and her being happy on it. That, that's enough for me. But uh, I figured I'd let y'all see this and uh, I'll get back on it. I got uh, a couple of projects I'll probably do some videos on this weekend. Got a uh, new addition to the junkyard. Well, a couple of new additions, but uh, I'll probably uh, do some more videos this weekend. I'll let y'all in on all that. Let you know how my duels is going on my very drive. And that's a video for another time, but uh, that's all I got for you right now, tubers. I got to get back on this, try to try to get this fixed so I can get it back there tomorrow. So uh, let y'all have it back. Thank you, tubers.